Hello everyone, just inside Dollar Tree and you can see all the beautiful Easter items that they have right now, especially these signs. Just, there are so many different styles. I love this one. I just think it's so well done. It's got a beautiful border and it's almost like a 3D effect. Well, it's layered for sure. I love these carrots. I'm gonna grab a package because these are gonna sell really fast. And look, they have the bottle, the bottle brush effect. I might grab one of these as well. I really like these black and white signs as well. I just am not a fan of the cutout. I wish that they were almost on like a rectangular board like this one. These are really cute. Super cute. Oh, I love this one. Okay, I have to grab that one. I'm going to take it down. So cute. Were these out last year? I feel like this color was popular last year, but I don't know if the print was. All right, let's go down the Easter aisle. Oh, some stuffies that I haven't seen. Cute little bunnies with... Oh, this one's a little lamb. Very sweet. These garland pieces, they're plastic, so just be mindful that some of them are squished. But they look like wood from afar. This one looks perfect. And all these are sweet too. You can add them to like a chain of garland. And you can make little signs with them. Okay, so that's going to look cute in my decor. Just browsing to see what we can put in eating. And an Easter basket, by the way, these Easter baskets sell really quick. I'm just going to walk over to the wall, see if I missed anything, because sometimes I do when I'm looking. See, they also have the very long signs, if you like those too. I only recently started carrying these at our local Dollar Trees. I had never seen these before. If you have any feedback, maybe you can share down below. But I just love the little packaging. So well done. Some jade rollers. These are cute. So I guess you would color them in. They're like a canvas with a little trim on the bottom. Super fun. I cannot believe these are at Dollar Tree. I swear I saw these at Michael's last year and they were like $10 a piece. Now the wood was a lot thicker, but look how cute are these? They have the, these are the ones, oh, this one's defective, but they had some on the other side as well. This is a really nice find. So these colors are so beautiful. The tulle mixed with some of the pretty Easter ribbon, wonderful for paper crafts as well. These are beautiful. You can decoupage them, paint them, distress them. There's so many cute, fun DIYs you can do with them. Actually, I'm going to purchase a couple and then I'm going to work on them. Hopefully share with you what I do as a transformation in a DIY tutorial. The gift tissue is so cute this year. Little chicks and bunnies. I love the pink one with the little bunnies. There's some more ribbon. I wonder if these little bunnies can be turned into like a chocolate bunny DIY. Aren't these signs so pretty this year? I didn't see them last year. And they have some fun treats. If you're putting together a gift basket and the kids are old enough for treats, they have a ton, like a huge selection, a great variety. Lots of different things. These are like the ring pops. They have the little eggs in different flavors. So those are like a Hershey, like the cookies and cream. So I'm down the stationery section and these kind of have that 1990s vibe. I don't know if you remember having folders like that as 
I guess, like a kid or a teen. But um, I'm actually looking down the section for the Happy Planner dupes. I know that there's something out there. I just don't even really know what I'm looking for. These are the bubble mailers. I'm going to grab a couple more because they're hard to come across, especially the pink. And I really like them if I'm sending a package out. And they're so much more expensive everywhere else. So there's the smaller size and then there's the fair full size. Like this one here. But I like the smaller size, especially for mailing out pocket letter. Yeah. Anyway, so I'll grab one of these. Oh my goodness. No way. I was thinking I would love to have some clear seals. So a little update, um, last I heard the newest release of these Crafter Square like vinyl pieces or vinyl paper or like this one is glittery and stuff I hear is way better quality than the first round that they released. So the second edition is better. By the way, We Are Memory Keepers has some pens here as well. I'm looking for the little peg people still. Haven't found them. They're completely sold out at every store I go to. Well, this end cap here has some really nice options for wood. Stars and flowers, all different things, even little animals treasure boxes, jewelry boxes. These little dividers are great for organization. They have some new containers out. These are new. They aren't as large as a typical shoe box, but they're great for maybe a craft room organization or a toiletry in the washroom. The shoe boxes are above. I like the pastel colors that are out right now, like the baby pink and the teal color. Very pretty. These are new, the wood clothespins, but they're a medium sized. So they're different than the regular wood clothespins. These are great for crafting. And then they have the teeny tiny ones. Lots of felt sheets right now. I always like looking around here to see if there's little pieces to add to shaker pockets. Like sometimes they have some really nice sequins. Has anyone used this double-sided tape and does it work nicely? I used to buy the red roll, but they haven't had that one in a really long time. See, this is what you can do with the medium-sized clothespins. You can just make little clips for embellishments and such. Oh, here are some more of the We Are Memory Keeper pens. I saw the other unit display, but they don't have any over here. New washi tape, and this is Disney. I know there are some huge washi tape fans out there. That's a great score. I'll take a look at the stickers and see if there's anything new here. Oh, here's some of the little fabric squares. I always like when they come out with the spring line. They always have some really nice prints. But this here, and there's some white. I'm not sure what you guys are doing with the white sheet. Oh, these are cute little stickers with the cupcakes. You can use them. Oh, they are the trolls. <laughs> you can use them to make birthday cards though. They have some 12 by 12 paper packs here. So if you need, this one's kind of got like a linen effect. It's kind of hard to show, but anyways, 
that's pretty new. These are paint markers. I paid so much for the ones I ordered on Amazon a couple years ago. If they've worked well for you, please let me know. There's a metallic gold and silver there as well. I feel like this trio pack is a newer combo. Glitter glue. Don't usually see like green, yellow, or green, gold, and red. And these are cute little wipe off boards. And here are a bunch of letters. So many cute toiletry cases. And they keep coming out with new ones. If you need one for school or for your backpack or work, just to put some of your private stuff in it. There are just so many cute ones. And also you can use them as pencil or pen cases. You can carry your stationery in them. I always think they work really well. There's some really pretty prints. Some are a little more durable than others. You just have to be mindful of that. Does your Dollar Tree carry an end cap filled with stickers? Oh, these are stamps. So there are... Oh, it does look like there's a variety here. Some beach ones. The little flip-flops are cute. I think that's the same as the one I have in my hand. Some more. Yeah, they're the same. They just kind of... Oh, there's butterflies back here. And some llamas. So there are quite a variety of them. I've been so good lately in not buying stickers and stuff, but these I think I'm going to have to buy because they're new and I think they'll sell out. These are really cute as well. They have quite all the sunflowers. These have like a stamp, um, a wax seal effect. Oh, these are new as well. They always come out with new packages like this, sticker books. So I just spotted some more butterflies. So I think these are the ones that I just picked up and put in my cart. But then they have these prints as well. Depends what style you like. I like the little polka dots, the gold polka dots. Every once in a while, I like checking out the bathroom accessories because I have found things from Walmart brands. And these are nice little dishes. You can use them as a paint dish, a glue dish, a bead tray. I'm so excited that these are back. I use them in my linen closet. It's my little trick and it keeps the dampness and my linen sheets all smelling fresh. So if you want to try it, I recommend the charcoal one. By the way, if you haven't tried this all-purpose cleaner, I actually really like it. It's a great disinfectant for garbage bins, things of that nature. And it has like a nice scent to me, in my opinion. I don't know if anyone else has any feedback on it, but, and I like the way it works. This is an aisle that I don't typically check enough. It's I don't know why sometimes I kind of jump past it, but it is one that you should check because they have some really great brand name finds. These actually work really nice, but you'll find Valida. Oh, look, Scotch Bright is here. So sometimes they have, you know, a nice supply of brand name finds and it's worth it because you'll pay a lot more for these items somewhere else so those are seats so um yeah i just once in a while scoot through here and they have the uh they have gloves they have the cleaning brushes they have the toilet brushes if you need to change yours out just a variety of things I was very lucky to recently on a Dollar Tree run find, what are they called? Oh boy. Oh, the flower sack towels. So I'm here in hopes to find them, but these are new, aren't they? This color specifically. I have some of the gray and the black ones, but that mint, almost like a sea mint is really pretty. Uh, 
Yeah, so they don't look like they have any of this, the flower sack towels, but if your store has them, they are so awesome. These are really great too. I have a couple in my kitchen. Well, actually one in my craft room, one in my kitchen. I'm gonna grab one of these for my glue gun on my craft table. I just like that they have the ridges. I have a Betty Crocker one. It's a little bit thinner and longer. I know some of you are asking what are the newest dishes that I'm spotting in the stores, but these were out of last year, or not, if not the year before, but they are ceramic. So they have the marble, they have the blue and white print, and then to be honest, I don't really see anything new. These are so well done. They're embroidered. Look at the detail on this. Now, microfiber is not my favorite, but super cute prints. Has anyone ever tried the sassy waxing strips? I'm just curious to know if they work well. Sometimes I see them pop up and they sell really fast, so I'm wondering, maybe they do work well. No way, this is why you have to look up high. Oh my goodness, mini gel lamps. I am having a fantastic day at Dollar Tree today. <laughs> and another find, oh my goodness. This is new, it's a little jade roller, but it's an under eye one. I don't know if it's worth me getting. These are also new, cuticle removers. They have the little lip scrubbers. A whole bunch of stuff from this Be Pure line. This is a little face massager of some sort, and it looks like it's a jade stone. Look at all of this. These weren't on the other end. I'm gonna grab a couple of these for my daughter. These brushes are typically expensive. Check this out. It's like our little money. Lots of St. Patrick's Day decor. They have these long signs. I don't know if anyone decorates for St. Patrick's or if you're Irish. Happy St. Patrick's Day is coming. I hope you enjoyed walking through Dollar Tree with me today and until next time everyone, bye for now. Try and